Hi guys, how are you? So tonight at the end of the live, um, there was a couple of people who had come in and one was Apollo Priest, I believe is what they wrote. And um, they said they were gonna send <sighs> Omea. Um, I, I, I know those, those letters are in the name, but uh, they said like connected to the moon and connected to the ocean, connected to the water. And as soon as I got off of the live, it started pouring, like, not pouring, but it started to rain, and now it's, like, pouring out. I don't know if you can hear it. It sounds like the ocean. And during the live, I was like, I'm gonna make, you know, water and stuff, and at the end of the live, I got a card that was like, do that. Like, specifically the things that I had said, down to, like, I'm gonna put witch's hazel in it, or um, vodka, if you don't have witch's hazel, and then in the, the book, it was like, boop, 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 boop. And I, and I got some blue lotus. The blue moon. I love the blue lotus. Oh, we got six people and six likes. Thank you, guys. And I'm going to add some of this. And I'm going to add some rose to it, too. Um, but that rose is downstairs. So I'm going to wait until after this is over to add those. But I'm definitely going to do it because I want that energy and frequency in there for love and, like, beauty and all that. Um... And then I'm putting my circle underneath it in the windowsill here. But then, of course, it's like I get some smoke up in there, too, just to cleanse it energetically. And um, while I'm live with you guys, I'm going to let these things sit in that window. And then afterwards, I'm going to go downstairs and fill this. I want to clean it really good. And I want to um, I want to add the rose. Like I'm going to add actual rose petals and, and rose, um, rose essential oil. And then add some of the stuff that will make it so that it's actually able to be a spray that smells good. Um, you can either use alcohol, like vodka or rubbing alcohol, or you could use witch's hazel, whatever you want, like a little tiny bit. That way, because water and oil don't mix, but if you use something like that, it will mix. So that's what I'm going to do after this is over, so that I can actually make like a decent spray out of it that carries the scent and isn't just like two things splitting away from each other. But this is one we did last time, being 369 in my head. And then the ritual rose blessings! Roses have been cherished for centuries for their sensual nature. They evoke the spirit of love and uplift the mood. Fine, fresh, or dried roses. I got them that have no toxic sprays or pesticides and fill them with prayers of love. If you use the rose petals in very hot distilled water, oh yeah, baby, and then um, approxim approximately one part petal to two part water. Steep for several hours overnight for more fragrant potency. Then for the rose bath, add both the steeped roses and rose water to a hot bath or a beautiful basin. Soak and scrub your face, body, feet, hands to nourish your skin and spirit. Welcome love and intimacy as you visualize flowers blossoming in your heart center. And then optional, make a second batch of rose water to use throughout the week. Strain all plant, Dude, dude. If you heard me at the beginning of this, what did I say? I was like, I'm going to make some rose water to do like this stuff. I swear to God, I swear to God, this whole deck was put away. I did not know that this even existed within there. And I'm already like planning on doing that when I get off of here. So um, I'm glad that I, like, I wasn't planning on doing that hot water part. I was just going to do like the roses into it, but I'm definitely going to do it now. And then um, it says, make... Make a second batch to use throughout the week. Strain all the plant matter out. Store in a large mason jar in the fridge. Drink as a tea or create a spray. And if making a spray, add a touch of witch hazel or vodka as a preservative or jojoba oil as a moisturizer. And then explore more suggestions for potion recipes online if needed. There are many. If you didn't see it, watch it back because I even mentioned the fucking vodka and the witch's hazel. If that is not clear, knowing weird ass shit, tell me what is because that was crazy. So um, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna keep it with that, and I'm gonna. I was like, oh my god! But I wanted to um, come say thank you to that person again who had. They said they were gonna send that energy, and I feel like that definitely came. And um, also thank you to everybody who came tonight. And I had said a couple of things during the live that I was like, I will make sure that I come back and and um, let you guys know. So right now downstairs I have um, the roses, like just like you know loose ro roses like rose petals um, that I put into a small thing and I'm, I heated it up on the stove for a little bit. Then I, and I've got, cause it's the blue moon. Okay. So I'm, I'm keeping with the frequency of blue. I've got this that I'm taking down there right now to clean. And I've got a glass over there that I've been charging up throughout this whole activation thing that I was doing. So this is coming with us downstairs and I have a blue vase down there and it's, it's just crazy to me that the, the, the rain is coming. So hopefully that person will see this. They said they were um, sending um, I, oh man, I, I can't remember the name. Omea or something like that. I, I will have to look it up to double check. I feel like I'm getting it wrong. Like, but I definitely feel like it worked. <laughs> I definitely feel like it's here because I can see it out my window. Um, the pouring rain. So I had said I wanted to clean this bottle 
this is my blue bottle the blue moon and uh, I've got the blue vase right there and I've got my roses that I put and then look at all the blue on the screen maybe that's why the blue's been coming in so much lately because of the, the blueness of everything so the bottle feels better already I did use a lot of um, different stuff within it like Palo Santo and um, what do you call it the, the moon itself, the moon energy itself, like focuses. But I used the moon energy. I did a ceremony. I did burning. I have more stuff to burn and more stuff to write. But I thought it was crazy that the that the rain started like this because the person was like, "I'm gonna send you my um." You know, like my, my spirit, my soul, my energy, and um, the leave they said, oh man, I don't know why I can't remember. I'm horrible at remembering <laughs> names, so that's probably why, because it's a name, and my brain is like, no names. Yeah, right? You can see all the blue? So I'm cleaning this bottle. It's been a while since I've, like, scrubbed it, because I don't drink it out of it usually but I do want to like I want to order a new one because I've put like oils and things up in here and just like you know let it sit for months so um I wanted to like scrub it down and maybe I'll put it in the dishwasher at some point I don't know if it's dishwasher safe it should be it's glass so I don't know why it wouldn't be but I do also want to utilize it in the blue moon try to get it as clean as possible and then I'm going to put this outside in the blue moon. And it was just 444, now it's 455. Um, so here we go. It's nice and full of water. And we have um, well water here, so we know it's good. And then I have this full of rose. Oh shit. <laughs> it just dumped a little bit on the floor, but that's okay. So I did like boil it, you know, so it's a little hot, but it's not as hot as it was. And I'm pouring it into here. I'm going to use this during the womb rite too. So the womb rites on the 31st, 7 p.m. in a private Facebook group. Um, these, this is like leftover stuff in there. Um, smells really good wow so I'm not even gonna use I'm gonna get rid of that stuff as like excess stuff they said to like you know steep it so I'm gonna put this out there too um, I'm gonna make like bigger amount I'm gonna make a lot so if people want some I'm going to make sprays okay uh, if you want to spray let me know actually I'm gonna put them on my Etsy for the blue moon rose sprays for beautifying and attracting and abundance and all of that. And um, I will I will also use a little bit for myself in a bath where you like wash your face and everything like that. So before I add the um, alcohol to it, I'm going to save a little bit for myself to add to the bath and like wash my face and everything with. Then the rest of it, I will make the bottles. I'll probably make like a dozen of them or so, and then um, have sprays for people to purchase. And I'm gonna put these outside. I wanna put them somewhere my dad doesn't fuck with them because every time I do something, he moves it or is like, what is this? And I'm like, why are you touching that sacred? <laughs> like, like my Lakshmi shit, when I was trying to attract abundance, he's like throwing things away on me. I'm like, ah, no. He's like, don't touch, just leave it to hell alone, man. The swan, the swan for grace. Been getting a lot of messages about grace, having grace and beauty. We got two swans in here. Swan one and swan two. And um, we get the bottles. Of rose water. Come on. Come on, wieners. Come on. Come on. Mana. Mana. Come on. 
I have a deaf dog. Come on. So, yeah. What else did I need to do? Oh, the egg thing. I'll get you guys the egg thing. And okay, so this is the person that I was mentioning before. Lim Limitless Living underscore fit is the person. And I'm about to put you guys on some fitness game. Watch this video. You better save it. You better share it because you're about to triple your monthly income. Are you listening? Pay attention. Yes. August 30th, we have a blue moon. A blue moon is a very rare occurrence because Ooh. it only happens when there's been another well, there's been two full moons in one month. So you're going to get a raw egg. You're going to crack a tiny hole in the middle. You're going to, I mean, in, um, at the bottom, you're going to empty out the contents of the egg. And then you're going to get a, a, a bay leaf. You're going to write an amount that you want to make on that bay leaf. Then you get a green candle. And then you're going to run that bay leaf. When you're done burning the bay leaf, you're going to put the ashes of the bay leaf in the egg. And you're going to use the wax of that green candle. You're going to seal the bottom of that egg. And you're going to bury it on your on, on your property. If you live in an apartment, get you a flower pot, bury it inside. And what your magic happens because I did this on August first during the full moon, and what I was manifesting literally doubled. If nobody has time to be broke in 2023. Onwards, every day, practice. Only works with people he considers prominent Mercury placements in their birth chart. So if you're Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising. Hermes is your guy. If you're Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Hermes is your guy. If you were born during a Mercury retrograde, yep. you want to work with him. If you were born on a Wednesday, you want to work with him. And he works expeditiously. When you write a proposition, petition to Hermes, make it short and sweet. Because he has a very short attention span. <laughs> or make sure that your petition is intellectually stimulating Otherwise, you lose his interest. You will know Hermes likes you, how quickly things happen. Mm -hmm. Like, I mean, quickly. He also loves praises. He's a god of speed, mm -hmm. and that's just Hermes. And right now, I am also finishing some of my new layered candles. I was only going to, I ended up adding some to this too. This was going to be a seven layer candle, but someone requested something specific with theirs. So I'm just, I'm going with the flow in the making of it. So now we are at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven layers. And there's going to be a final layer of protection on them. These two are going to be Nag Champa. That one's going to be Palo Santo. But um, yeah, they are customizable. You could do seven, eight, nine layers, 10 layers, 11 layers, whatever you want. But I, I use like the different recipes that I have. So, you know, there's um, Divine Masculine, Morning Coffee, like, and they're all about manifesting love and abundance and um, sex magic and love spell and, you know, just plain abundance, Divine Masculine. It's raining, man. Hallelujah. And then all those things. So, yeah, I'm going to be putting that listing out soon, but you can just request one from me. They are $44 free shipping in the U.S. If it's outside of the U.S., um, I'm going to have to do like $66 for those because of the shipping fee. But, yeah.